What's that for? Give it a shake. It's my hand, isn't it? I don't like doing that. Yeah, well, we all have to do things we don't like doing, but we do them, don't we? So give it here. Because I don't talk much, people think I don't have anything to say. I might be able to help you. I'm not clever enough. And that's not true. I have lots of things to say. I'm just afraid to say them. How'd you do? How'd I do what? Nathan Ellis, the dragon. It's not often we have a mind like yours spring up off the radar. He's mine. Been Nathan's teacher for seven years. Why don't you walk properly? I've got multiple sclerosis. Why are you weird? I've got special powers. Nathan is on the spectrum. Traits of autism. He's a unique young man. You have successfully earned a place on the United Kingdom mascot. Oh my goodness! I'm going to go and study. I'd really like to carry on teaching Nathan. Really? If that's all right with you. Close! Bit of a weird one. You are the cleverest young brains in this country. We will be training with four other national teams in Taiwan. Nice to meet you. If beauty is truth and truth is beauty, but then surely mathematics is the most beautiful thing of all. A one followed by a one turned into a zero. And that means you can't keep taking away from a positive integer without it turning negative. Good work, everyone. It must have been very difficult for you, being just you and Nathan. You're not with anyone, are you? You're going to do amazing things in the future. You haven't. You charming little bastard. This is the most prestigious place to study mathematics on the planet. Can you say that word? Hypotenuse. Bless you. <laughs> Somebody loves you, it means that they see something in you that they think is worth something, adds value to you. I'll try and slip you somebody else, it's all right. That's cheating. You know, I was joking.